So Jordan Woods is back in the news again. Some people are upset, some people are finding this funny, some people are critiquing it. We just gotta get into this. Hey guys, it's Marad Marodi. Hope you guys are doing well today. Back again with another video. If you haven't subscribed, click that button for daily and consistent content. Head over to my Instagram at Murad underscore Marodi. Subscribe to the channel, click that button guys. And let's just get straight into this video. Right, so Jordan Woods has announced that she is joining OnlyFans. And this itself has kind of, you know, sh irritated and shocked people. Some people said, imagine if Tristan signed up. <laughs> Can you actually imagine? Um, Kylie Jenner's ex-BFF, listen, she doesn't, she's not known as Kylie Jenner's ex-BFF right now. She was before, but now she's known as Jordan Woods. So please begin the article with that name instead. Jordan Woods joined the subscription-based adults content site. It kind of irritates me when I see a lot of celebrities join the site. It's not for celebrities. I feel like you guys are oversaturating this entire site. It's for people, for SES workers. You know, it's their main job. And I just feel like a lot of celebrities are coming in and just taking over and it's just annoying. It just, it genuinely is annoying. For a monthly fee of $20, fans can have access to the content's 23 years plans to post on a page. I'm not coming on there to take away from anything that SEX workers or anyone on the platform already built, she told Complex of her new venture. I just feel like the bigger picture is that it can be a space for people to be on there, to not be judged and to be authentic to ourselves. Several workers came out against Bella Thorne as well when she joined the platform over the summer. Sydney Leathers, Anthony Weiner's ex-partner who now make a living on early fans called Thorne a spoiled, entitled rich girl who wants to grab as much money as she can and doesn't care about who she's hurting. But Wood said she has good intentions by joining the site, explaining, Growing up, I've been shamed a lot, being a curvy girl, being young and seeing the skinny girls wear short shorts because it's hot outside, but I want to put on shorts and it's provocative, or I want to put on a tank top and it's provocative. What the hell are you talking about? Woods has teamed up with Stephen Gamillion, one of her absolute favorite photographers, to create some interesting shots for her page. We're creating art on here. We're not posting just random selfies. There's going to be really edgy, iconic photos of me on there, and it felt like OnlyFans was the right platform to launch this project because it's completely different than anything that I've ever done. I feel like, you know, her saying, oh, I don't, I'm not trying to take this away from workers, but then going on the platform anyways, you are taking away from workers to an extent or damaging them by going on it. Don't say one thing and then do the opposite. It's just, it's hypocritical. I don't think that's no different than what um, Bella Thorne was doing. You're all going on the platform and you're also damaging a lot of workers who aren't celebrities, who use this money as a full-time income to pay their rent, to pay their food. And when you have all these celebrities going onto this platform, it saturates it and damages the market. That's what it's doing. Because you have a lot of people who want to pay for this. I don't, to be honest with you, I don't know who would, but yeah. I know that's because of everything I've gone through, I knew it could be very controversial and I could avoid the controversy. But to me, it's about the bigger picture and the opportunity that I see. I felt like it was a great opportunity and I'm so excited to join it and be a part of it. I'm even more excited for my genuine supporters and followers and whoever decides to join gets to see that part of me. Every single day I get tweets or comments saying, when are you dropping the early fans? Listen, people are saying this to me as well. Like, I'm not even trying to like front, uh, like front. But I have people on the ground saying, when are you coming on? I'm thinking, when are you getting out my comments? That's what we need to know. When are you talking? Well, what is this wahala that you're talking about when I'm going on to early fans please what is this like imagine i'm doing daily and consistent but early fans god forbid can you actually imagine how daily and consistent and you're seeing me there every day way wow wow and i bet it's going to be shocking to some people but when they understand the bigger picture i think it all makes sense anybody who does have an early fans i feel like it's great for you if it's a way for you to get money non-celebrities especially non-celebrities those who are on early fans and are banking coin Good for you, do you understand? Good for you, and I feel like it's great. If there's a way for you to make money, go for it. I'm not mad at it, I'm not shaming it, and I feel like it's great for you guys. I just find it irritating when we have a high saturated amount of celebrities that go on the platform and they damage other people who really need this. They need this to benefit, to, to help their lives, their livable income. It's, it's, it's crazy. So we have a lot of people now who are going onto OnlyFans. It's that transition period. It's kind of getting normalized, to be honest with you. Um, not that I have anything against it. Um, it's great, if you, if you wanna go on it, go on it. You, a lot of people actually go on OnlyFans and they don't do anything related to um, explicit content. They just do cooking, chef work, um, just to make vlogs, talk to the family or friends, not, not family, but friends and stuff like that, not friends, just their fans or whatever, I don't know what I'm talking about. But a lot of people go on the platform to not just do it. So she's not doing anything related to that, but she's posting kind of like edgy photos when you could have just made another Instagram account. But of course the coin was there, she's gonna benefit from it, most definitely. Imagine me now doing OnlyFans. I wouldn't even be mad at it. I would actually even do it, but I would never post anything new. That it was, it's never gonna work like that. Impossible. I feel like it's just not something that I feel that like you should be doing because it can come to bite you in a way that you don't want. So I would never ever do it in that capacity, shape or manner. 
but these people everybody is banking guys a lot of people are making a lot of money from like up to 10 million 5 million a month it is a lot you can make on this platform let me know your thoughts are guys when it comes to this subscribe to the channel click that button and i'll catch you guys soon for another video because this video is not meant to be that long but i'm just talking